here's my point. The warriors. Here, here's my point. It could mean a lot if the brother goes out there and shows you a little something, something. The fact is, is that if you're another team and you're watching what you believe to be as a decline, how much may you be willing to give up for? Because you can't just let Clay go for nothing. Exactly. You can't do that. Exactly. I know, but I don't. It's Clay Thompson. But 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 look. And you know I've been very, very critical. Wendy and Stephen A. are the Golden State Warriors. But when it comes down to Clay, I strongly believe it has nothing to do with the game of basketball, why he is struggling. Again, I'm going to tell you this, right? Mm-hmm. Playing with – I played with over 12 Hall of Famers. You name them. Right, KG, right. Paul Pierce, right. Ray Allen. Right. The list goes on. LeBron James. When something was bothering, bothering them in their personal life, we did not get the best performance out of them. Until they got it cleared up, until whatever they was going through, yes. we did not get the best version of them. Right now, I don't believe hold we're going to get the best version of Klay Thompson. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I get that. And I'm not trying to say that doesn't factor into the equation. Of course it does. But there are moments when you just got your ass kicked. It ain't that complicated. When I watched Booker give it to him last year, Klay Thompson admitted in the offseason, Booker was giving it to me. They were looking forward to this. What happened the other night? Klay Thompson shoot 2 of 10. Booker dropped 32. I mean, some, I understand there's some stuff going on in your head. Don't get me wrong. But we're talking basketball right now. Sometimes you just run into somebody that whips your ass. And that's what we're talking about when it comes to Devin Booker. And so when you look at it from that perspective, now we got to look at are you quick afoot? Are you the defensive player that you once were? Obviously not. Now it's affecting your shooting as well. Why is that? You can say psychologically, or it's because you can't create the space that you used to be able to create. You can't post up and shoot turnaround jumpers over a cat the way that you used to. As your skills are dissipating to some degree, others are elevating, and they're calling you on it. And Klay Thompson is admitting they're calling you on it. He, Devin Booker is the first, and I can't wait to see Devin Booker against uh, – Paul George, by the way, that's going to be epic. I'm looking forward to that, but that's a different subject for another day. At this moment, Klay Thompson has to show us that he can remind us of what he used to be. We ain't seeing that yet. It's the bottom line.